So he get mad, you know what I'm saying, get swole like he want to do something. I'm like, what you want to do? So I'm chasing him up the alley, you know what I'm saying? I'm a little chunky. So yeah, he was getting up on me a little bit, but it is what it is. I bet you I caught that ass. <laughs> I hit hard, boss, you can't tell me nothing. Spit fire, burning shit like a fucking toaster. Your main bitch wanna pull me closer. What's good, Mo Mafia? It's your girl Mo. And y'all, today I got some young smash burger. I'm gonna be telling y'all a little story time. Y'all already know. I got the fries right here in the middle. Got some ketchup. I got the classic grill. And then I got a bacon double avocado burger. Now, y'all. This food was very expensive, okay? So I'm gonna need y'all to go crazy on the mats, okay? Period, all right? All right, so y'all, today I'm gonna just be talking about a quick little story time um, about when I had my first fight with this dude, right? So we gonna get right to it because I don't want my food to get all cold and nasty. You already know we gotta say the prayer. God is good, God is great, and we thank him for this food. We gonna thank him in the morning, noon, and night. Cause God, God, God is dynamite. Amen. Amen. Game. I noticed y'all like when I say it like that. Let's taste these. Let me give y'all a taste first. They're, they're uh, rosemary uh, olive oil. Uh, Rosemary olive oil, uh, what is it? Rosemary olive oil garlic. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I ain't eat all day. And funny enough, you took it out of the mind when I say that, but I'm not lying. Some of y'all think it's unhealthy, but... You know what I'm saying? In order for me to be able to do mukbangs for y'all, I gotta eat once a day. I don't have to, but I choose to. Oh, where you going? Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. All right, y'all, so, first I think I'm going to try the chicken sandwich, the grilled chicken. It got lettuce, tomato, onion, and grilled chicken on it. Take a look at that there. Mm-hmm. Give y'all a 360 spin on her. Yeah. Bread toasted real good. You know I got the extra mayo. Got to have the extra mayo for sure, for sure. Put a little bit of that on that there. Look good, Mari. I hope this not cold. Y'all, it is cold. I think I'm gonna warm these sandwiches up because it took me a long time to set up. So I'm gonna pause this and come right back. I'm gonna warm these up. All right, y'all, we good. So first, I'm gonna get a bite of this chicken sandwich. So i have warm and good. Right. Mm-hmm. Look at that chicken. Mm-hmm. Mm. That ain't bad at all. Mm-hmm. No more red onion. Make the pot. Fry. Alright. So y'all. Let me taste the burger and then we can start the story. So double bacon, avocado, add cheese. I'm definitely not gonna eat both of these. So I can I know I know that. Mm. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. <coughs> One more bite. Look at that. I'm gonna tell y'all is about the time I fought this Caucasian dude. I ain't gonna say white because I don't wanna offend nobody, even though I just said it anyway. Mo, that was dumb. But so I was about 13, 14, you know. This was middle school. A little bit after the Haley situation. <laughs> If you watched my last video, you caught that. So, fry is gone. <laughs> Period. So, I stayed in a Milwaukee Dunn on Silver Spring. And I remember it was these, like, kids who stayed around the corner. This is where I first met my, met my best friend, Raven. Shout out to Ravy, baby. I love you. And it was this white guy, or this Caucasian boy, who stayed on the same block as her. My guy Troy stayed across the street from her. You know, we all used to kick it. Now, all I know is, is this was around the time when lice was bad. Yes, I said lice. Lice, it, hair lice. Right? And blame mama, my real mom, Mona, if y'all want to shout out to mama, I love you, mom. He used to tell me, don't you dare let nobody who's not black wear your headgear. Because I used to wear hats and stuff all the time. And I had to be like, why not? Why can't, you know, I got white things, why can't? You know what I'm saying? Why can't they wear my headgear? He's like, lice is really bad right now. And I don't want you to get lice. Now, I was always under the impression that African Americans couldn't get lice. But I guess I was wrong and mama knew something I didn't know. Mmm. That burger is right. But anyway... Well, already uh, getting four at least. Anyway, so um, my mama, you know, she told me that. So one day we was playing, we was outside kicking, you know, playing maybe catching the football or something like that. We was doing something. I don't remember exactly what we was doing. But all I know is that the white boy, I can't remember what his name was, y'all, but all I remember is that he, um, no, I think his name was Alex. So, Alex had reached, like, to take, no, 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 I'm lying. My hat had fell off my head while we was playing. And he picked it up, you know what I'm saying? I didn't think nothing of it at that, when, at that moment when he picked my hat up. So, he picked my hat up, and I reached, like, my hand out to take it from him, and he put it on his head. Yes, y'all, he put it on his head. First thing go through my kid mind is I'm gonna get in trouble for getting lice. I'm don't call me on the age. I have to be between eleven and fourteen. I don't remember. But I was I was a kid, y'all. So that's the first thing went through my head. So I snap, give me my Fucking hat. You know, and I snap it on. Or whatever. I'm like, don't 
don't put my hat on your head. My mama said white people got lice. Now, y'all, I'm a kid at this time, okay? Keep that in mind, y'all. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? We all say some weird shit when we young. Mmm. Mmm. That burger. So he get mad, you know what I'm saying? Get slow, like he wanna do something. I'm like, what you wanna do? Now, y'all, Alex, I don't know if that was his name, but we gonna call him Alex. Alex had the braces that had the thing that went out, like he had one of those things. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Like back in the day when you got braces, you had to wear like a thing that kind of came out your mouth. He had one of those. You know what I'm saying? He talking shit. Fuck you, yo, fast. Da, 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 da. I'm like, man, I beat your ass, boy. Who was you talking to like that or whatever? He's like, yo, fat ass. Woo, woo. And I'll take your hat and run. You can't catch me. Excuse me? Boy, okay. Try me. Try me. I looked him dead in his face. Do you know this boy snatched my hat off my head and ran? Y'all, when I tell y'all, my house was at this end of the alley. His house was at this end of the alley, but across the street, double. So it was like the alley, the left side of the street, right side of the street, that's where he lived. My guy Troy stayed right here across the street from him in Raven. So my house right here, we in my yard. So he run up the alley to, he ended up in the back of Troy yard. Now they had a big ass backyard, no fence, and it was a tree right there. Now, we always used to, like, cut through Troy House to go to the store. Everybody used to trip over the tree stump. It was a tree stump right there. Everybody used to trip over that damn tree stump. So, I'm chasing him up the alley. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little chunky. So, yeah, he was getting up on me a little bit, but it is what it is. I bet you I caught that ass. <laughs> so, he ran up the alley. You know what I'm saying? He run up the alley. He get right there to buy Troy house. Dun da da da. My best friend, the tree stump. He tripped over that fucking tree stump. And I'm running behind him. Like, I didn't stop myself because I'm not thinking about the tree stump. So he fall over the tree stump. I fall over him. Get up before him. I. Dude, I, I grab my hat. I get up before him. I grab my hat out of his hand. He didn't put it back on his head. He just ran with it. And I pushed him. Bow! Mow! Mow! Mack! Mow! 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 Mack! Mow! 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 I'm tearing his ass up, y'all. When I say tearing his ass up, I'm giving him the bid I is. Whooping his ass, right? He all I heard, my braces, my braces. So I stopped hitting them and shit. My brother come grab me like, get off him. What is you doing? I'm like, he, he put my motherfucking hat on his head. My mama said, don't let nobody white put they hat, put, put your hat on their head. My brother get the cracking up laughing, like dying laughing, like Mo, it's not that serious, bro. He probably don't even have lives. I'm like, how am I supposed to know that? Like, seriously, how am I supposed to know that? I don't know whether or not he got lice. All I know is he white. <laughs> so, that's what happened. Now, he get up, his mouth bleeding. I'm looking at him like, you should never ran with my hat. Call me all out my name and thought it was sweet. Boy, no. Just like that. You know, and I rang the neighborhood chat for a little minute in the hood. You already know how that went. Man, Mo whooped this hat. He took her hat, man. She whooped this hat. I felt bad because I'm a good person. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. Really? You couldn't go to the bathroom upstairs? You making more noise if you would have just walked past. Annoying. 
So anyway, y'all, uh, I feel bad or whatever because I didn't beat up, beat him up. He looked soft. I'm a girl. He a boy or whatever. But it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, you should never did that. You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? Later on down the line, I apologized to him. He apologized to me. We still was friends or whatever it is, what it is. It wasn't no biggie. But, yeah. He just... I just felt disrespected because he made it his made it his business to snatch it and run with it like it was sweet. Like I just wasn't going to do nothing. Not cool. Say this for a quarter of a burger. But yeah, y'all, that's pretty much my story time. Now that, that was after the boy incident at school. But yeah, that was like later down the line. So it is what it is. I wasn't, you know what I'm saying? I got over it eventually. So y'all, that's pretty much it. I wanted to do some shout outs, but you know what I'm saying? I'll do something tomorrow during Tell It Tomorrow Tuesday, all right? Because I'm full and now I don't feel like going through my phone. All right, Mo Mafia. We finna get lit because we the shit, gang.